Well, here we go again. Yes, we're yeah. back. No, but, but before then, we're getting reprimanded by the producer. Always. always, always. You, saw, you know always, that, right? Always, you go, it's always. like always before we start, it's like, Manny, you got to look over here. Forget Kiko, you got to look over there. Anyway, we're on another podcast yes. of A Day in Miami. And it's a great day because Kiko's going to introduce the next guest. But yes. this guy comes a long way, and he's a long friend. And he's going to tell us what the hell's going on and what the new stuff he's doing. Kiko. Yes, I like to introduce my buddy Ernie. How do I say it? No, you say it. You I want to hear you Porta. say it. Porta. No. no. Puerto. No. Yes. Porto. Portonado. No. <laughs> wow. Portuondo. Murder. Portuondo. Portuondo. Damn. Anyways, wow. forget about this the pronouncements, my boy Ernie P. <laughs> Ernie P. And uh, he's uh, my boy, and I wanted to bring him on here. He took me fishing the other day. Ernie, you want to introduce he yourself? Did. He did. What's up, guys? Thank, thank you very much for having you. me on a day in Miami's podcast. Sorry, Sorry for brother. messing up that intro for you, but uh, no, no. It's the last a... name always throws me off. I call him Ernie P. or I call him the it's mayor okay. of Tavernier. Either it's way, it's okay. It's your last day on the boat, anyway. The good, Go ahead, Ernie. The good, good news is that it is your last day on the boat. <laughs> butchering my name about fifty times, Manny. You've been tagged in, how bro. And we Manny, practice, please. In. No, but I love him dearly. Listen, tell, tell everybody about yourself. Oh, yeah, before you go there, the Portuondo name Portuondo, is a very, very well-respected yeah, no, last that, name that, in this that, community, that, brother. It was until he butchered it. <laughs> Port- he killed it. Mira, mira, he killed it. Portuondo. So you got it. Porto. Applause, 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 there you go. Applause, applause, applause. It's a, you know, nobody has the teleprompter that I have. That's the problem. I have my no, teleprompter. No, no, it's a difficult name. We practiced, <laughs> but I still messed it up. It's okay. Welcome, it's Ernie. Okay. Thank you for coming to the show, bro. I was dying to have you on, and I know you know Manny for years. So I, I really wanted to like chat it up with you, and uh, we've been working kind of on some projects, and I think we've known each other for like two or three years, and I'm in love with you, bro. So that's about that's it. Coño, right? The skipper oh. is in love yeah. with you. No, I say the truth. I say the truth. So uh, welcome to the show, and um, I know you and him have history. Well, yes. Well, listen, Manny. I, we want Ernie to talk, and we yes. we want Ernie to say what he's doing. Um, uh, I've known Ernie for many many years. I'm my wife. Absolutely. Every I yeah. mean, it's 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 one of those. The Miami thing, no? Mm-hmm. As we all say, we're all related. You know, right. you call it the Cuban cousins here. I, I laugh with some friends of mine. They go, oh, no, my cousin, my cousin, my cousin. All, all I know of you, you're the only yeah. child. How many yeah. freaking cousins do you have? But anyway, it's, it's a Miami thing. I brought the maritime theme because Ernie <laughs> lives on the water. There I think you go. This is the first time I see him on dry land. Bueno. And he took me fishing the other day, which we'll talk about I, later. I saw it. I Reason saw for it. The I, hat. Saw it. I saw it. Because I got no fish, but I saw it. Because I'm crazy. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Go ahead. Ern, talk to us. What's new? I mean, I know we can get into a whole bunch of stuff. I mean, uh, we know Ernie from years of of uh, running and doing and, and chairing uh, Kiwanis, yes. which is a great organization in our Latin, community. Latin builders. Latin builders, uh, everything else. But, uh, you know, that's all stuff that's been already, yeah, in the past. What's What's been brewing in the future? What's going on? What's cooking? What's, 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 cooking? what's, what's cooking? What's cooking, right? Yeah, bro. So what's cooking with us? Why don't... We're getting old, Manny. I yeah, no, you no. and I uh, are no, getting no. old. We were just but talking about it. No, estamos riquísimos. Vaya. We're getting old, pero yo estoy más mono. You heard it here first. Estamos riquísimos. Yo soy Miami. el baby, entonces. Yo soy well, el baby. No, tú eres el baby. The tú eres baby. Un niño <laughs> <laughs> but anyway, eh, what are we doing? Um, I've gotten older. Um, I'm doing the same things I've always done, except when I was supposed to be slowing down. My kids have me speeding up, oh, and I, please, I know brother. you know what that feels like. I'm You're running this empire right oh, now, God. and it's like, what happened to us? Now we have a phone in our hand all day long. Yep. We look, we open up our eyes in the morning, and it's you got a nine o'clock, you got a ten o'clock, you got a twelve o'clock. Oh, we used to be at a brachi at this time hanging no, out. No, no, what are you talking about, bro? We, we were, we're done what for the week. What time is it? It's Don't talk about a rachi them stuff. We were be there since 11.30. My table was already ready since at 11.30. 11 30. <laughs> we walked out at 5.30 on the way home. No, you didn't even know it was daytime. Yeah, exactly. Turn off the lights. But all right, schedule after schedule, schedule and appointment yeah. after appointment. But anyway, listen, um, after the Latin builders, you know, Kiwani's early phase of my life where I was in banking and mortgages, um, I, you know, truth of the matter is I burned out. I, I burned out from it happened. that whole 100 mile an hour thing. Miami exploded during that time. I, You know, I didn't feel good about the direction that Miami was going in. And I think I needed a, a check. So I took a step back. Um, I gave up running the mortgage company. I went to become a loan officer and get in touch with people. What I really missed was the one-on-one with people. Okay. I was born a salesman. I, I want to be with people. I want to talk to people. I want to meet new people. I'm, I'm with you. I'm That's with what you. I want to do. And I ended up just managing a, a train that was out of control, and that wasn't for me. So I started fishing. Like, I, what's my passion? Yeah. I, I started fishing. I was building a Bertram. Went out to the Bahamas and fished the, the Bahamas Billfish Championship for Bertram. And they said to me, hmm, why aren't you selling boats? People are talking to you. People like you. People Huge business, brother. You Huge should sell business. boats. And I said, how do you do that? 
I said, wait, be at our office on Monday. We're going to get you a broker's license. I walked in their office on Monday. They gave me a broker's license. And I started my career in in yacht brokering and boat brokering 2005, right? Damn, right before the been crash. It's been a while. Yeah. Yeah. <clears throat> right before the crash. And um, about three years after that, um, we were bought out by a Ferretti group. And I decided that once again, I was managing a bunch of people and not what I wanted. <laughs> and I opened up Marasul Marine. I, I, I just walked in. They walked in. They told me, you were bought by Ferretti Group. You're flying to Italy for corporate meetings. And I was like, ah. Well, but at least you took the Italy trip, no? No, I no. didn't. <laughs> no, I didn't take the Italy trip. I would have taken the Italy trip. I literally and said no. walked out the door. I walked out the door. I said, oh, yeah, I'm done. Yeah, I'm not doing this okay. again. You know? And I walked out, and I opened up Marasul Marine with my wife and my daughter. And, um, beautiful, we're beautiful. Here, fifteen, sixteen years later. Um, and but, but uh, to his point, because you guys are old school, you're not that old, but you guys are old school. He's adapted well though, because he's got great Instagram stuff now, that, where he uses that platform. Yeah, you know, and, and to sell boats and, and properties that he does as well. But the videos are so intriguing and so beautiful. They're like, bro, whatever that guy's doing, I want to be doing. You know what I'm saying? And that's where I came in, and you know, a couple years, and I'm like, yo, this guy, you know, oh, he's that, he's doing this, and. We met and and you know, we're very similar, you know. He's a little more intense than I am, but yeah, no <laughs> point, yeah. brother. Nobody but, will believe wow. that shit. But, nobody but, will believe but, that. But uh, the content was so yeah. good that you know I don't even have a fucking boat. You know what I'm saying? And I wanted to be on that boat, and I was lucky enough to go on a boat with him on Monday for Earth Day, and uh, he showed me you know his world, which is great because it's the Keys. We grew up in the Keys, but I didn't see it from that side. I hadn't, you know, like have all those contacts and these beautiful boats that this guy's driving on a daily basis and the fish. Yeah. I caught a ton of fish. He still was like, oh, I'm not, I'm not happy enough. I need to see more. I need to get you more fish. I'm like, right. well, listen, I, calm down. It was great fishing, dude. Yeah. I mean, <laughs> and at the end of the day, if you're, if, if, if it's the whole vibe, man, is what that's, I'm saying. That's what I'm saying. The vibe. And if it's something that you really, really listen, you know how everybody tells you, you got to love what you do. Yes. You got to love what you do. 100%. So I really, back, admire, I really admire, I really admire you in the sense that you, you know, listen, I love what I do. And and I tell you, I admire you for what you're doing right now in the sense of, of what you just started in the sense. I think you're working more now than you used to do, but you're doing something that you really enjoy. Absolutely. You're in the totally ocean. Right. You're, you're, you're fishing. You're, you're providing these services. So I think it's something that really gives a motivation to a lot of people. You know it's what I'm perfect, saying? A lot of people it's all are, tied into his business, the way he lives. Absolutely. Life. Absolutely. So I think it's like a little bit more at the And, you know, everybody sometimes says, go on, you're not everybody can do that. Yeah. Well, I, I mean... It gets yeah. to the point. Yeah, he he does have funny content. Who yeah. comes up with all of it? Do you do your own shit or you? Ron, I'm a clown like you at heart. No, so yeah, no, no, no like it's funny I shit need though. Very little instigation <laughs> to get this wrong. Like, very little well, instigation. It's funny. It's informative. All you have to do is just put a phone secretly and you just yeah record no, it on a My daughters, they That's have created it. a monster. Yeah, and those are the ones that are behind me. Daughters. My daughters run our businesses. We have family businesses. That's what's pushed me more to the keys. Mm -hmm. They run. They each run one of my companies. And I'm free now because they're older women to go out and uh, explore more yeah. content and, and become Bro, more relevant. Every time you say that, every time you say that crap that they're older women already, I really feel old. Ah, my daughters are 30 and 25. Damn. Damn. No, no, no. I, I, the, I started late. So I, yeah. for yeah. me, yeah. it's a. Uh, but you're, you're you well start a little later. Than you're me. well familiar <laughs> with the keys too because you had a oh, home I, for a long time, right? And you, yeah. you and Noam Nernie, what, 30 years? Listen. Ago. I, but we've known each other for many, many years since the LBA years, yeah. you know, and, and I always say, well, I'm not going to get into that, but, you know, LBA when I want to say when it was LBA, yeah. you, know, heyday. you know, it's hey, they know, it's hey, no pun intended, it's, but it's, it's, it's LBA. I mean, you know, everything has moments and everything, but it was like anything, you know, it was a very, I think at that time was a very powerful organization. Very powerful organization. I think it still is. And, and man, and you know, we were part of shaping what's here absolutely, today. This explosion absolutely. In Miami. Absolutely. Yes. Our, our mentors at the LBA and the people that we worked hand oh. in hand with basically built this. They came here from Cuba with nothing and they built Miami into a destination well, that everybody wants. To and be. the intentions were perfect there, which right. was we got to help each other. 100%. So it's, you know, everybody takes that, 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 it that, was a squad. That, that page out of that book, you know, if you came in, you were a contractor, you, you, you hire the roofer, you hire the tower guy, this hire the window guy. So everybody got a piece of the pie, you together know what I'm saying? The and then, and together, and that's Miami, so, you know? So, so my question would be in Ernie with the economy, either good, bad, whatever opinions people might have, who's buying boats? Cause these boats are big, right? These aren't regular little boats. I've been on the one that he had. It's yeah. a big ass boat and the properties he has too are beautiful, but they're up there in price. Let's be honest. Is there a huge demand, and, and is the keys opening up a little bit more now with property? 
and who are who are your clients when it comes to the homes that you try to sell or the boats? Are they from out of town? Are they local? Talk a little bit about well, that. That's, my clients are are very um, they're they're almost they're identical to Miami. That it's everything. We're selling fifty thousand dollar boats, hundred thousand dollar boats, ten million dollar boats, and everything in between, which is incredible testament to the to resiliency of the city. But you're busy. People are buying. We're busy. People are buying boats. And and how sick it's Miami, brother. Are we struggling or are we? we, uh, It's Miami. A lot of people are struggling, and it's it's very weird. We live in very weird times right now. But I do know that this city, and when I say this city, it's South Florida. Right. Let's talk Palm Beach to Key West. Yeah. Yeah. I feel like we're in this in this world where. We're running bubble. different than everybody else. Miami, USA. I keep on saying Correct. every Correct. time. This is not. This we're our own country. Yeah, we're <laughs> our own <laughs> country from Palm Beach to Key That's West. It. And That's property, it. people that coming in for big. That yeah. that oh. is what you said. That yeah. is unfortunately, it's um, the keys has become ultra luxury. I mean, and, and no. I don't think there's anything you can. Because do you just about reference that. about that. Does that community even really exist like that anymore, <sighs> brother? Yes. When yeah, when absolutely when we started in the key the our keys house and to Ernie's point, our keys house was in the family for almost forty years. So when my in laws bought that, they they paid for the house that they're like I think it was like ninety five thousand dollars. You know, a house on the water. Right. You're talking about the sense that a lot of those folks already have been leaving the keys and a lot the keys. So you're is cycling. A, it's a cycling. So it's for example, my parents bought. Yeah. Two miles up the road from where Manny lived with his family, yeah. and where I currently live, which is Hammer Point in Tavernier, I grew up in Buttonwood Bay, two and a half miles right north. there. Beautiful My parents bought too. in 1974 with their family yep. as a group for forty thousand dollars. Buttonwood. So I've been there since I was four place. years old. Yeah. That's my backyard. Is yeah. what I'm I love. I'm super interested in the subject because I want to retire like in ten years. And wow. I want to live where you live. Damn, you're you're heading those, that way. Those are good aspirations, bro. Yeah, we got to do what 50, he's doing. 55, I can't retire in 10 Wait, years. I'm at midlife 55. Now I'm more scheduled <laughs> no, out than no, I was no. at 35. Look, I don't know what being, I did wrong. Being Cuban on my side, we don't last too long, let's be honest. <laughs> <laughs> We're not 90-year-olds. <laughs> I mean, oh, no, but I, my goal is it, it, yeah. is to to obviously have a plan to retire, but I want to have like what, what we spend on Monday, mm-hmm. that you're ha- the way you had everything, like that's what I want. You know what I'm I mean, it's it's amazing to be yeah, able to walk out your back door yeah. and jump on your boat Bro, and go that fishing. Was an I mean, experience yeah. that, yeah, you know. But the way he had it set up and the ease and it was, no, no, listen, oh, that's man, a, it's what that's I want. the beauty of the keys having it's the water. Like you wake up, you yeah. get on your boat, and you just take off. For sure, like I would have signed. Like five, if you would have had a home, my neighbors available. Even worse, I'll sign. Yeah. I'll ask Uncle Manny for the money. Oh, here we go. Uncle, Uncle Manny. Wow. Uncle Manny's buying house in the keys. You guys heard it here first. Listen, tell me no more. Let's tell them more about this because I went fishing. I met some of your captains, right? Yeah. So not only is he selling boats, there's charters. So what give that, give give us give it, give us a charter. Give us a charter. Well, you got a yeah. charter. Tell us about no, but tell us about Marasul. What does Marasul do? Marasul, when I started, I just sold boats, and then as we started to grow, I realized that it's the same thing as the land mm-hmm. builders and the philosophy. We always dad take care of our own, right? right? So I said, Manny would I'd sell you a boat, and then you'd call me on the weekend and say, oh, "Hey, this is not working. I don't know what to do." And I would run over, but I was only one person as we grew. I opened up a service department, and I opened up a manage, boat management department. So now Marasul sells you the boat. They fix the boat and maintain it for you. We wash it weekly for you. We do everything for you. So basically— No, none of the keys is, is golden, bro. We do it from golden. the keys to Miami. We do yeah. it everywhere. You send an email on Sundays. I use the boat. This is what's wrong with the boat. We work out of Regatta Grove, right? We work out of— we, we, Marina, we, yes. We run, the, we run the Regatta Harbor Marina for the I developers. I've seen it from the video. You should see the video, bro. Yeah, no. I've been the boat You already have one, bro. No, 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 no. That's uh, well, I, I'm I have a feeling it's going to be called I don't, need, go I don't need to do that when I can just get one from him. <laughs> so don't worry about it. It is, it is exactly a great right. service, and the captains were amazing, but I had the best time. You met Captain Jason. You met Jason, Captain Mike Captain Mills. Mike. Yeah. Jason hey. runs Fish Coal Runnings out of uh, Fort Lauderdale in Miami. That's important. And uh, Captain Mike runs M&M Charters and M&M Sport Fishing in the Florida Keys from my, from Key Largo to That's Marathon. Tremendous, tremendous service. I had the best time. Yeah. Um, what's going on now for the future? You're still going to be banging out those social media videos. You guys got to follow him. Because he's funny. Uh, it's not only informative, but it's entertaining. I gotta yeah. know. We've got a ton of content in the can. Yeah. As you know, that's, we got that, that's only got YouTube. YouTube. That we, did. we got some YouTube. My YouTube channel is currently being built. What's it um, called? What Boats call? and Homes FL. Boats and Homes FL. I like it. I like and it. our it's website scripture. is Boats yeah. and Homes FL. So as, I, as my daughters took over the company, and they've kind of put me out to pasture, except when they need you, which is every no, five no. minutes. Yeah. You know? Um, every, every, every 15. Wait, they I don't said, let us Bobby, do the important stuff. Bobby, right. this, service, this service is best they, for you. You get your boat, and you get to go home without the boat. 
That's well. That's <laughs> my type of boat. Yeah, that's my type of they boat. They filleted my fish. That's my they type of gave fishing. Me a thousand Gatorades. Yes. That's it. I bro. had that's the best it. full that's service, it. and it. not just because he's my boy. I well, we're not talking about the fish dip, the world champion. The fish <laughs> dip. He made a fish dip that's the best fish dip I've ever had. What? Well, Say it again. Say it again. No, it is the best fish dip I've ever had. Yeah, and man, I want I'm, you to send me that soundbite. No, we'll, fig- we'll, fi- we'll figure it out. No, we'll figure have, it out when we have someone over here at the office. We'll have, have the office go ahead and try But it's the best damn kingfish fish dip ever. So I tried to replicate it. Maybe Ben will drop that video of me making the fish dip to try to copy it, but it was the best. Maybe. It was the best. You know what they say, right? If you really. If you really have admirers with recipes, you always yeah. give out the recipe, but you leave one no, ingredient don't. out. One ingredient out. Course, brother. One Everybody ingredient out. So I gave them the recipe. Oh, yeah, wait, that time. The most important I, I ingredient is to, not in I there. I tried to duplicate it yesterday. It's yeah. better than mine. Ernie, so tell me, what what is what, what is are you seeing more people? You seeing a lot of a lot of people from out of state coming in and, and chartering boats, or are people really from Miami that like to really like? I, I have great friends of mine that are into what just Kiko said. They have boats all their lives. Right. Got rid of the boats. Yeah, tired of Everybody running. wants to go go fishing this weekend. I charter a boat. Go and resolve that. And Absolutely. Now, do you times, see that more a... in my local, or do you see more people coming mm-hmm. out from other places? I think it's probably right now about, about 60% outside money okay. and 40% local money. Okay. Right about there. There's still your <laughs> diehard locals. That means a lot of people getting seasick. Yeah, well, but still, that's a shitload of people still from here, from Miami. Hey, yeah. You strip char- you still charge the trip, yeah. so hey, yeah. you know. it's There's uh, an incredible amount of wealth in Miami and and, and, and uh, boaters, and forget wealth, just boaters that are such avid boaters that they're going to do anything to take out their fifty or $60,000 boat, which it's is a beautiful fantastic. Job. Yeah, and it's great to get away from the city. I mean, the- it takes away all your headaches. Oh, oh brother. I mean, hey. Listen, I mean, you go out there and just just the fact of just standing there and just trying to fish, yeah. it's really just serenity. You're Long you're like time. another it's a peaceful set of mind. Trust me, 100%. it is. Even the people that don't even like the, the water. I yeah. mean, it's another world. You really you really can really focus yeah. in life there. Um let's see. One of my last thoughts was are you done with philanthropy? Never done with philanthropy. You're big on yeah, that. No, we've worked together can. in the. Yeah. He's been one of Never our. Uh, done with that. I think we worked with him on the toy drive. Absolutely, which was Absolutely. amazing. Yes, of course. Um, that's when I really found out that Ernie was the truth when it came to who he is as a person. But um, yeah, I don't. I don't think you're going to give it up, to right? I mean, no, I'm never giving up philanthropy. I just, I just retired as the chairman of the foundation. We're both retired. I retired from TV. He retired from, from the wait. chairmanship of the Kiwanis of Little Havana. What am I doing wrong? That's it. That's yeah. it. We're going to fish no. and, and, and and have drinks and that's it. And make sandwiches. Hey, you heard it here. Living the life, Lux life. Right? No, well, but got... no, but emphasize a little bit on that. You you, you shared and you, you, you took seven that... years as a Kiwani. Yeah. Um, I, I still have an incredible amount of passion for the organization. It's just um, I'm living in the Keys most of the time. Correct. And, it's and different. I, and I think that it, the takes, drive, a lot, yeah, yeah, it, it does. takes a lot it does. to run one of those places. And I didn't feel I was giving enough to the organization of myself. So I went ahead and, run, and, 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 and retired. Um, and my good friend George Toti Fernandez is running it now. Um, and he is going to take over the rest of my term, which is another six months. And he'll run his term now. Um, and I'm still a supporter of the organization. We're still sponsors of all their stuff. But it's time for me to go back and focus on me and what I'm doing. And- Absolutely. I you did, a long right. time. Well, yeah. but at the end of the day, you, you, you weren't selfish in the sense of saying, I'm not going to continue something I really can't put my full effort right. in. And, and I and I The way I am is, that, and course. if you know me, and you know me, Kiko, it's yes. 100 miles an hour full throttle. Oh. And I wasn't able to give that to them. I didn't have enough yeah. for them. So I needed to just let somebody else do it for a while. Is the rumor true? Are you going to run for the mayor of Tavernier? Is that is that something? <laughs> is that something on the on the blogs or is that? Oh, why not? Wow. Like a rocket. I mean, if, if 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 it's permanent residence. promoting Tavernier. Well, let me tell you. We'll, I'm we're a gonna, fan. I'm no, no, but we'll run the campaign. I'm a fan. We'll oh, run the oh, campaign. Oh, there you go. Oh, you're putting back on the. I I don't do that much for many people, by the way. Hey. But we'll run the campaign. If campaign he's run it, if he's got, not campaign manager. I didn't say campaign manager. Yeah. Those years are done look, for look, me. Look, I, if I'm fucking around with it, but I think it's a model. great. It's better to be a kingmaker than a king. Please. But know. at the end of the day, I mean, if he runs for a tavern here, I think that'd be spectacular. That'd be the spectacular. Day, the day they establish that position, you heard it here first. I'm running for that. I think that'd be great. But no, Tavern, but no, we'll just make the whole. We'll do, uh, oh, yeah. I mean, I we'll had an accident on that key and it's still good button. But no, could you? But you got you got to face your fear. You got to go I, back I and look, no you got to go back and look at that. You got to literally stare it down. You got to stare it down again. But bro, your whole vibe, bro, is something that I'm a fan of, bro. And you, as a person, is you know something that I like to hang. I like to surround myself with good people. And you're you're a little bit older, so whatever you talk, I listen. Look, you got to wake up happy and every day. just a little bit older. And you got you got an awesome boat and and you know how to fish. So I'm definitely gonna be your friend. Ha, ha, ha.
for a long time. At least he speaks the truth. Oh yeah, he doesn't hide it. He doesn't hide it. No, but um, um, but a lot of fun stuff. Coming. Before, before yeah, we go, what, what did we catch the day? What did you catch? What okay, you so catch? I caught uh, we caught a fit like a forty pound, fifty pound sailfish. Damn, I'm gonna put the mm-hmm. pictures in. Ben's gonna hook me up. I but we we did kingfish, which I smoked and tried to compete with his, which I lost. We caught uh, right, mutton snappers. Okay, and they tremendous. wanted to catch a thousand, but I caught a good number that I was happy with. A little bit of mackerel. We caught a really cool tie. Red, red groupers. The red, no, red groupers. We got a season. The season opens May first. We even caught a nice trigger. And I had the best time, bro. But it said, be sure the attention, the captains, even if you don't know how to like to fish or, or even yeah. if you don't know how to fish, this is where you're going to learn and you're going to have the best time and you're going to be safe. Because I did have a boat accident really bad and I went right back on it and there was not one time where I felt unsafe or he wasn't uh, uh, worrying about how I'm feeling or our guest. And so I wish you all the luck. Buddy. So Marasul, tell us, Marasul. Where, where can we get everybody at Marasul? If anybody out there wants to... IG, the boat, IG, there's an IG is. There, it, Marasul Marine IG. My IG is Ernie Portuondo 32. They'll all be okay. in the description. We'll, we'll put it in the description. The fastest yeah. way to get to all our stuff, if you want a place in the Keys, you want to buy a boat, you want a charter, you go to boatsandhomesfl.com. That's the name of our of our YouTube as well, Boats and Homes oh, FL. Man. Um, but our website takes you, and you'll have Marasul Marine and our real estate website I right there. How many properties on. are any more or less there? A, in the, a, Properties in yeah. there? There's over 200 properties in Perfect. our office listed right now for Perfect. people to look at anywhere from 500,000 to 25 million. Also, just I mean for rentals or just? Rentals, purchase, purchase? Okay. okay. Same Perfect. And your IG, he's got great, Perfect. great content where you can see everything we just talked about. And uh, I'm going to put the pictures in there because those pictures And are we cool. got some stuff for you. I got some restaurants in the Keys that want you to come down. Well, that's important. And check them out. Maybe, all, maybe I'll invite you. You know, no, my, no. the biggest question I get is, where do I go eat in the Keys? You know what? Yeah, we got to go, go, right. go down right. there and eat, so our, way. But those are, eat our way through the Keys. Those are three. people that don't know the Keys. Because there's so many places so many to places. eat in the Keys. There's so many places. People think they know the Keys until they meet homie. Yeah, but I'm telling you, there's and just then, so I, many I didn't places. even know that whole side where he lives. Oh, like, what? God, oh, yeah, bro. Been... There's there's places yeah. that you think that and, and, they're behind. Like, where is this? Exactly. Oh, and and where he lives, you don't have to take that half an hour that I made to throw everybody's backyard. It's like... You're on the ocean side. Oh, right? no, no, no. Yeah, well, side. that's the great thing about Tavernier. You go right out there, Bro, boom, and you're... About right, yeah, I didn't left. know the details until... No, Tavernier is one of the... the, the the it's best the hidden place. secret. It's, it's a, a hidden, hidden secret. secret. It's, it's not Largo. too far. It's not right. too close. For me, the best one, I mean, you pass Key Largo, you have to have any air, which, you know, again, listen, our, all our viewers can really, you know, yeah. chime in. What's your pr- favorite? You know, you like... You know what? Yeah. Do me you a like favor. Comment Tavernier, like Key Largo, you like Ilan Morada. Exactly. You know where do you, you, know you like saying? to eat? We where do you like know. to eat? You know, And then what we want to do with you is you want you guys to come down. Yeah. And let's eat our way through the keys. Let's eat our yeah, way from Key Largo to Key West. All the way to Key West? Yes, oh, sir. In La Faja, man. No, 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 no. <laughs> no when, you, when you end up at Lobster Listen, Fest in, 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 in see, Key West, yes. we'll, do it. It. we'll do it through the summer. We'll do, we'll do it in pieces. Yeah. We'll do a couple days, a couple days. With food is very And I'm telling you. I want to know. I want to know what Manny does. Let me tell you. Let me tell you. Mira, going to pinky up. Let me tell you something. You would see, you, you see me in the keys, you go, Coño, I can't recognize that guy. Este no <laughs> really? Yeah. That's no, what I love about the keys, brother. The keys, you go, and you're in keys. Different vibe. Different, vibe. different vibe. Different vibe, brother. You got to gotta let go of the, uh, you gotta let the, the still, loafers still and everything and put on the flip flops. Gucci slippers for sure. <laughs> flip flops. He's got Gucci slippers for sure. Yeah. I think he's got the Gucci flippy right. floppies. Well, no, listen. This has been a fun one, man. Go it's ahead. Good. Sign no, us no, out. No, no, no. I just want to say, Ernie, bro, it was great to see you. Thank you guys for and, having me. Much, much luck, brother. And uh, you have a home here in a day in Miami. And we will, uh, next time I find out there's a fishing thing that I'm not invited, we're going to have a problem. No, 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 you're on the list now. <laughs> hey, by the way, we're going to, we'll, I guess. Try to we'll, book a schedule. We'll have to uh, check and uh, make sure Turtle's not available that day. Oh. oh. I'm staying out of that one. We'll see you in the next one. Thank uh, you, thank to Ernie. Thank you, guys. Thank you, Ernie. Bye, thank guys. you, Ben. Thank you. All right.